Getting ready for a romantic date with someone special this Valentine's Day? Tonight, I'm going to show you how to get a soft, romantic, but still sexy look. Let's get started. I'm going to be working with the Rose Romance Eyeshadow Palette by Lancome. Starting with the lightest shade in the palette, I'm going to highlight underneath the highest points of my brows as well as around the inner corners of the eyes. Next, with a fluffy brush, I'm going to blend some of this pink eyeshadow along the hollows of the eyes. Next, taking this purple eyeshadow onto a small brush, I'm going to trace along where the eye creases to add more definition. I'm also adding a little bit more towards the outer corners of my lash line and blending to tie everything together. Now I'm tracing that same purple shade along my lower lash line and pulling the line out at an angle when reaching the outer corners. This is going to create the illusion of a shadow being cast by the outer corners of your lashes, making them look longer. To highlight this double winged effect, pop a light shimmery shadow in the space between the lower lash line and the top. I'm adding some more purple along the outer half of my upper lash line just to intensify the look a bit. Continuing with the lashes, I'm going to take a tiny liner brush dipped in a dark matte eyeshadow and start sketching in little lash-like marks along my lower lash line. This is going to make your lower lashes appear so long that they cast shadows. Next, apply a very black, volumizing mascara. I'm using Lancome's Hypnose. Decided to add a touch of the peachy color to the centers of my lids to add more dimension. If you like false lashes, I recommend using half lashes when going out on a date as they're less obvious and you can put them on very quickly. Now let's finish up the rest of the face. For the cheeks, I decided on Lancome's blush in Cedar Rose. It's a beautiful peachy pink. For the lips, I recommend a pale pink, almost nude lipstick. I'm using Lancome's lipstick in Pale Petal. Look.